been a crazy title race. With eight games to play, we're currently second in the league to rivals Real Madrid, and we're both on 74 points. And we're also in a UCL quarterfinal playing Dortmund. We're currently winning 1-0 on aggregate. And this side is playing pretty well right now. Of course, we set out the goal at the start of the season to challenge for the title in the league, which we are doing, and also to reach a Champions League semi-final, which it looks like we could do that. But this dude is saying we should swap out Depay for Carrasco on the left. And to be fair, Depay hasn't really done a whole lot this season. And when Carrasco's played, I feel he's done a bit more. Of course, if you guys are enjoying this series, leave it a thumbs up, subscribe if you're new. We now have Valencia at home. We should be getting three points in this one. And we get a 2-0 win. Right now, though, with a goal and an injury. Hopefully, that's not for long. And Lorene. We do now have that second leg versus Dortmund. And unfortunately, that injury was too weak. So we're going to have to bring in Lodi, which is fine. It's the same rating. He's got good sharpness. Oh, but I'm noticing Jimenez and Romero are slightly tied. I'm not going to rotate any of them, though. It's very important in this second leg that they both start. If we take a look at that bottle job FC squad, they've got Bellingham still there. Emery, Chad, Brandt, Haller up top. Good defense as well. A strong side, but I feel we should be winning this. Oh, no. Oh, no. He slipped through. He shoots. Oh, he didn't get enough under that. Good opportunity there for Dortmund. It's Angel Kret. There's a gap there for Griezmann. He slipped it. This could be the second goal. That's right, Griezmann. It's 2-0 Atletico. He gets a silly celebration out. What's he doing now? What on earth is that? But that is a great assist. Perez slips it in behind him. That's a fantastic finish on Griezmann's right foot. Here's Jude Bellingham for Dortmund. Oh, that's a fantastic pass. Oh, he's hit the bar. We have really got away with one there. A third goal in a game like this would completely finish it off. Travella there. He had to get his hand to it. That was Carrasco. He's looking to have a big game here. It's Lodi. He's going to shoot on that left foot. Straight down the middle. Now here comes Dortmund. If they want to get back in it, they need a goal. Good defense again. Now here's Griezmann. That's a ball. Can we get that right in behind there for Correa? He is on side. Angel Correa. Hard shot. Three now. We are in a Champions League semi-final. That was a fantastic finish by Correa. It's not even half time yet. And we have absolutely humiliated bottle job FC here. Ball over the top there for Correa. Can we get a fourth? Oh, we do. Is there any point in playing the second half? 4-0 on aggregate. Well, Correa's a nice bit of space there. We get the ball in. Could be another goal it is. Look at that. 60 minutes in. An hour into the game. 5-0 on aggregate. Well, that's it. That's how it ends. 5-0 on aggregate. Patrick Angel Correa. Fantastic. Now back to La Liga. South of Vigo away and we get a winner in the last minute of the game, Antoine Griezmann. And also in the 28th minute, so he scores a brace. Look at this. Six games to play, and we are second in the league. Three points behind Real Madrid, but we have a game in hand. We need to win to go level. It would be very helpful to win 7-0, because we would go top of the league on goal difference. But is that really going to happen? Oh, we get a winner. Don't want to save. Where's a big opportunity? Why is he shot? We did just have a big opportunity, but the game shot it as soon as he got the ball. This most broken game mode ever. Here's a fantastic opportunity. Don't mess this up. Angel Correa. Oh, one now. There we go. I'm not going to let the game mug me off like that. Roberto Firmino's on the pitch now. Slips that to Correa. Now back to Firmino. Oh, we've done their defense there. Here is Roberto Firmino. 4-2-0. Oh, what a save. Not quite 7-0. I mean, we could be conceding here if we don't get this right. Ball out wide. Oh, he's messed that up. And that is full time. We have escaped one there. Ooh. Look who we have in the semi-final. We have PSG. And to be fair, that is a weak PSG squad. They don't have Mbappe, Messi, or Neymar. They definitely haven't solved them players. They're definitely just deciding not to play them. I don't know why they're rotating against us. They're very confident if so. How do we line up in this game? I don't think we make any changes. We played so well in the last one against Dortmund. So here comes the first leg. And we lose 3-1. No, are you kidding me? That's probably us out the Champions League. The Battle of La Liga and in this game we are fully rotating i'm confident we can get a win here still a very very strong rotated squad to be fair but here we come away from home a 2-0 win jal felix and Firmino. but what a massive game this second leg is it is massive now they're playing mbappe i see how it is laporte at the back marquinius kimpimbe to be fair alaban hey Kimi, that is one of the best back fives in the game right now when it comes to us how we gonna line up do you know what i'm actually gonna start to pile on the left i, I feel he's gonna be a big player in this one. We are at home. At least we have that advantage in this one. Here's a mobile. It was a good signing, by the way, for them. Oh, that could have been a goal. Nice defense. They score one goal. It is over. Here's Koke. Now Griezmann slips that out wide there for Correa. He's going to pull that inside. He's going to go for the angle. Could have been a handball. 
Oh, no. Mbappe! Oh, come on, man! We're out! Kylian Mbappe! So unfortunate. So unfortunate. I don't really know what to say after that. Just just disappointed. The Rene slips that in behind that. Ball Diego to low. Back post. Someone moving in. That's a nice ball. The goal was to reach the semi-final. I mean, very disappointed not to reach the final. Oh, this could be another goal. He's onside as well somehow. Mbappe. What's he going to do here? Oh, get out. What's the point? They're just destroying us here. Crazy that. Quarter final. We beat Dumman 5-0 on aggregate. Now we're losing 5-1. And now it's half time. Is Memphis to pipe. Oh, this could be a goal. Antoine Griezmann slipped through. Can he get a goal versus the French side? He can. Don't celebrate. That's embarrassing. Especially your celebrations. I mean, 5-2 down, that'd be humiliating. Oh, and he is doing something silly. Are you having a laugh? Can we at least make this scoreline look competitive? That's that's all I ask. One more goal here would, would be good. Well, that is a nice gap. We'll go to Bendit. Good save. Now to pie on the ball. Now looking for DePaul. He could hit this one. He does. Good save. And that's it. That's full time. A 5-2 loss in aggregate to PSG. They'll be in a Champions League final. We have four games remaining and we're both on 86 points. We only have two losses, by the way, and they have four. Check that out. We now have Athletic Bilbao here. The first game of the season, was it? I know it was one of the first three games of the season, but I'm going to make a few changes here. I'm going to bring Lottie in there at left back, and we're also going to put Firmino there over Griezmann. Oh, no. Look at this early on. Garcia. Oh, he's rapid. He's so quick. He's so fast. Here's DePaul on the ball. Come on. Someone make a run. I mean, standing there is not going to help. Is it? Get a ball out wide there to Lorena. The Paul in a nice space. Correa moves it on. Roberto nope. Oh, no. 13 minutes left to play, and we need that goal. It's still nil nil. Roberto Firmino. Edge of box. I'm doing it. I'm winding one up. Pass shot. It's blocked. Come on, please. Keep the ball. Keep the ball. Look at this. Yeah, Condogbia out wide. Look at this. Look at this play. Number 19. Get in. What a goal. We're going to get three points. Diego to low. Now we just hold on to this lead, and we defend it. Wait for them to turn the ball over, and that will be game. Oh, no, it's Megstus. It's Megstus. I don't believe it. I don't believe it. There was an offside, and that's full time. Now we have Mallorca at home, and it's a 3-1 win. Madrid, by the way, are not dropping points. We're still level. But now we have a Lecce at home, a 4-0 win. I mean, we are so good this season, but are Madrid ever going to drop points? Oh, it's still level at 95 points. To be fair, there's three goal difference between us. Goal difference doesn't even make it make a difference, does it? I've just realized. It might do, because they beat us 5-1, I think. Then we beat them 2-0. So because it's level on head-to-head, -head, it surely goes down to goal difference then. Let me know in the comments. But for our final game of the season, we've got to be going out with our strongest side. And this is our strongest side right now. Ooh. No, no, please, 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 please. We have a free kick here. A big opportunity. Come on, Griezmann. Get this one in. Over the wall. Nope. Oh, the keeper saves it. Why? Left-footed free kick takers, man. I just can't do it. It's so much different. You have to put so much more height and power on it. Is Correa is going to finish this. This is going to be a goal. There we go. 13 minutes to play as well. Oh, we're just about getting the job done against Osasuna. Tell you what, I'd be interested to see how many goals Correa has. He could get another hit. Angel Correa, what a player. They're down to 10 men. We get a second goal. Do we really need a proper number nine next season? Oh, and look at that. They win the league, Real Madrid. We both get 98 points. They beat Almeria 3-1 away. Look at that. What a season. How has this squad done that good? Antoine Griezmann, 28 goals, 21 assists. What a player. These are Pellegrini numbers. 26 goals, 5 assists. Correa, that is insane. Who is this guy? Lino. I mean, maybe he gets a, a place in the squad next season. I mean, he's putting up some pretty good numbers. I mean, that was a pretty solid first season. 98 points. How on earth did this squad manage to do that? I mean, we'll be making improvements next season. Perhaps we even go to a 4-3-3. Go more attacking next season. Let me know in the comments. Get your transfer suggestions in as well, by the way. Of course, next season, we'll have brand new kits. So if you're excited for that, leave a like, subscribe, turn the bell on so you don't miss that video. If you guys want to see a Barcelona current mode, click my second channel here.